if you really want to power up a character quickly in this game you can honestly just go into rogue lands and start up a character because as we saw from my last krieg win that the giant loot explosion at the end gives you uh, a ton a ton of gear that you can just be like hey if i'm looking just for a way to earn myself gear but i don't want to play the entire game get yourself a rogue lands win i'm telling you it's harder than you think and if you can actually get there i think you earn you you've earned the gear let's play some maya already starting off with a fire burst grenade it's gonna really help me against that those those tough fire damage enemies a long rider i think i'd much rather have this times two Hyperion. Hyperion. Uh, the Banshee class mod and adaptive shield. Pushka me. Sick. I think I, might, I think this might be a Pushka angle. Let's see. Homing transfusion. I already have a. I already have my own. I already have one that's better. I think. So let's go ahead and five points into we're gonna go down into the ruin tree as quickly as possible magazine size reload speed me it's pushka angle for sure all right so coming off of krieg when i'm trying to make maya work as well because maya has been my second worst character beside behind krieg but i do have a win on her now the, my win on her ended with me getting a lot of candies Let's just use a, a fire burst. We got some of these enemies, especially if we get rabbit skags. I feel like shotguns are good against slag or skags and like these kinds of areas where snipers are more for like human and robots or stationary targets where you can line up crits easier. Again, if you're but if you're playing Maya, of course, you can just face lock and get land crits no matter what. Need max pulls at the box in this run. Need a B for dragons and a legendary siren for 10-5 war to keep it charged. Okay. You're right. I did a lot of pulls to the box last game, too. I don't think I actually... I, don't, I didn't purchase a single SDU all of last run on Creek. I did all pulls. And we actually did not get... We got a, a win without best in slot gear. So we, we have a, a method that works. I, I need to shout out the, the YouTube content creator. I forgot the name of the, the channel, but I, I watched the guy yesterday and after watching the guy i literally got not even best in slot gear and pulled off a win so guy was very very helpful it, it was it was helpful more than just like oh this is the gear you're looking for it's it was helpful like this is how you should play and the, the big playstyle shift that i had to make was oh wow i just went through all the ammo that's crazy the big playstyle shift that i had to make was uh, meleeing less just melee less just throw the throw you can throw your buzz axes that's gonna be your primary damage source but your but your melee attack is primarily just to get your melee kill skill to to increase your uh, grenade damage and then throw against raid bosses you can't activate those kill skills so you just kind of you just kind of go ahead and with the understanding that you're not going to be able to use them that much or you uh, not be able to uh crack that kill skill but is what it is uh i could think an anarchist is a good uh, addition to the squad here a homing slide transfusion is good but, but again i want the just the outright damage of the fire burst against sla uh, skags for sure sdus aren't at all necessary except rockets and maybe nades unless your uh, main gun is an ammo hungry like interface or something okay yeah i can see that Let's see. Pick shield capacity. It is Maya after all. Oh, cooldown right. Never mind. Very nice. A little cooldown right action, which means that if I didn't get cooldown right, maybe I would use flicker here, but let's go Helios. It's basically like having Helios is like having a, another grenade. It's like it turns your it turns your action skill into a grenade, basically. Fire damage one. Let me take that and let's go ahead and climb to the top of the the thing here to get our pressure plate all the rights have ammo availability in some way even terramorphous does terramorphous have ammo availability get me up there nice 
See, a fire diamond thinking is an absolute beast of a gun. That gun looks kind of funky. All these diamond thinkings, holy cow. Okay. Last red chest and we head out. Maybe not tear, except the tentacles. The tentacles do drop some. Okay. Because I was born, I, I've actually thought about that. It's like, do I ever need to take SDUs at all, ever? And it's like, yeah, sometimes you, I feel like you do. Take all two phases. Like, I, do I take all SDUs? Do I take no SDUs? All SDUs? No SDUs? And I try it. I try everything. Box pulls seem to be very important. I'll say that. SDUs are important, but box pulls seem to be very important. And if you can supplement... If you can supplement... Um, the box pulls with just basic Borderlands knowledge of uh, different gun types that are powerful, then you don't need to SUs as much because you can just use a different style of weapon. You're right here. Let's use Helios and watch the burn. Yeah, I'm not sure how much that it was actually doing, but it works out. No, you haven't been trying to tell me that for months. You told me that, I think, a couple times. And look, I internalize what you say. I've been doing it more. It's not like I'm ignoring you and suddenly going to this realization. Alright. Phase lock. And grenade. Later. Oh, rabbit skag, huh? Want some of this? Want some of that, huh? Doing that much damage to rabbit skag is actually really nice. Let me go right in and go for those critty crit crits. Nice. Yeah, I like to learn by trying things out. Exactly. Like, people... Someone giving me their idea of what they think a strong is... Is good. I, I want I want people to tell me their idea of what they think is strong. It's going to help me make informed decisions. But I gotta... I gotta... Do what I think is right in the end. Okay. Let's see... I think this, just the fi- I, I don't know. The defense from this class mod, I think, is pretty nice. I might just keep it. Don't really need anything from that. The fire rate would be nice, but... Cloud kill and Helios are going to help us, like, ridiculous amounts. Helios for flash damage. Cloud kill for corrosive damage. And pressure plates for weapons. Our early game is looking pretty nice. Maya does have good TDR synergies. That, that looks pretty nice, but I'm not taking it. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. La da dee, la da do, la da dum. Alright, what do we got? I think this one, the team cooldown rate with he Reaper and Helios. I don't have Reaper yet, but the, the even more cooldown rate, I can just be spamming my action skill for like for days. All right, let's go. I always take max pulls of the box though and use the left iridium for rockets or grenades unless I have a Lyudo or interface that burns ammo. Okay. I think I'm gonna, I think that's basically been my my approach is like try to be as greedy as possible with box pulls, especially if you don't have uh, the gear. But if if I if I feel like I have the gear, then I just kind of if I can't think of a single thing that'll make it better, then I'm probably not gonna be using that thing that makes it better. You know? Okay. Okay. That's not a power up. It's just a, that's an item. Let's go for the uh, the hidden objects first here, then go grab, grab the chest after. Oh, you want to do that, huh? No, this isn't gonna be like one of the, my last rounds where I couldn't take you guys out. This time I'm ready. Get a gr grenade out there. Later. Yes, sir. See ya. Got some nades. 
Maya's damage is so insane that you can just... I mean, the fire burst grenades on, on their own just do so, so much. Gatling guns are cool. Two times three Jacobs. What can I replace? I mean, this shotgun's doing very, very well. Sniper could come in handy. Ah, uh, whatever. Take care of the anarchist. Go Gatling gun. Walk around here. Yeah, cooldown on Maya. Yeah, absolutely. Cooldown is king. For sure, for sure. Let's see. Chinook. Troublemaker. I don't, I'm not going to be using those, I don't think. Let's go up and over. Gatling guns. Yeah, I mean, they're fun because they got the triple pellets, too. That makes them good. Okay, let's take this this uh, launcher instead of the other one, for sure. Boom, 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 boom. Get me up there. Oh, let's go. Two ammo per shot, but it is fire. If we go up against Hyperius, I'm sorry, if we go up against Terramorphus, it's probably going to be our weapon of choice. Let's see... SMG gun damage, fire rate, blah, 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 blah. No, 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 no. <laughs> Again, we, I, I really want to farm up these red chests because if I can get myself a legendary siren, we could be off the races. And that can save me a lot of time with the box if I can just get, knock out one of my best pieces of gear. Legendary cat as well. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, I gotta collect my reward first. Long Rider or Presence? That's just an absolute travesty of a mission reward. Siren is best comp for her. Yeah, it is. I think so, too. I think so, too. A tough zone, but let's just use our, our shock damage to ramp this up. Here we go. A lot of these guys have shields. Oh, come on. That's not good. I'm going to lose all my health. I need to take five points of something. How about some Reaper? So when I peek this guy, I can do more damage. Here we go. Looks like we're playing CSGO. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That, that's a ridiculous grenade throw. Get, it, get it evaporated. also want to be shooting these right here. Okay. Pop goes the weasel. Come on, mad dog. What is it? Flat off sniper rifles obviously go hard. Oh, wow. Did he add a cloud kill? That's interesting. We're almost completely done with the stage. Yeah, look at that. Fire burst, Helios, cloud kill. Makes it, makes it very difficult for someone to... I mean, this this Brash needs this guy higher shots across the board. Seems very similar. So we take it. Helios is busted early game. Yeah, I feel like it does a ton of damage to flesh, damage to flesh enemies. What did he drop us? A sloth? It's time. It's actually time for me to try this loft because I've I, I've heard that it's good, but I haven't put any respect on it yet. So I haven't really tried it. So it's a good time to try it. All right, chain reaction. Let's do immolate. It's almost too good. You can barely take advantage of wreck. I see. So the sloth kind of one shots. That's okay. Listen, I don't need I don't need wreck to do damage if the enemy's already dead. <laughs> I don't need I don't need more damage if there's nothing to fire at. I'm down down for the one shot. Oh, I keep I keep I mean the third bunny's there is what it is. Oh, I meant heals. Oh, true, true. Okay. Maybe I should just use this Vlad off here. 
Not bad. Boss. So his shield should be down now. Oh, he's still getting rinsed by my grenade. We can only use the uh, the fire burst against these next the first two enemies, so might as well take make use of it while we can. What was that for? Hey! Stop struggling. Okay, let's go. Time for maybe some sloth action. Oh, I accidentally just threw that. Okay, no, it's homing in. That's sick. Oh, that's some deeps right there. Burn them. I'm out of I'm out of uh, sniper ammo though. What we got here? Oh, we got this diamond thinking. That's good. Oh, right in that. Oh, that's gonna do some big deeps. I'm st st I am getting pulled in though. I don't like that. Those homing grenades are so nice though. So so nice. Sloth is a good gun, just burns ammo. Yeah, just, I, I just got my, all my ammo depleted. Um, let's swap out our grenade for a sl slag transfusion. That we immediately throw, even though we don't need to. Oh, it did slag him, though. Let's go. We, it's, it's for the utility. We don't have, we don't have, um, ruin yet to slag enemies off of our face lock, so... Let's go. Hear me out. They should have made Amara the Beastmaster class. Like a Siren Beastmaster. Because you have magical powers. Like you're the character that should be able to tame animals. And it's, it makes sense because Sirens are like in tune with nature. Because they have like elemental powers and stuff like that. Okay, let's see. Lako is good. Jolly Roger is fun. Stink Pot? I've heard is good on, on Maya. Let's see. Maybe we take it. I like the Creamer. I like the Jolly Roger as well. Okay, let's get Ruin. And I, I do struggle about what to take next. Because you kind of want Wreck and Sweet Release, but um, there's not a... I mean, sweet, if, let's take... We got to take Sweet Release, right? Just in case this... Is it, if it is Hyperius, then there's really no reason to be taking Sweet Release, but most of the other bosses have someone you can try to kill. We have lots of different types of weapons and stuff like that, so... Let's just hit the box. Tunguska. I'm going to have to make a decision here. Anti-affection and the Kazar. There's too much good stuff. Come on, please. Okay, that looks like a... Infection. Is that any good... Is the infection cleaner any good for throwing? Or, de or, or shooting? Anything? Um, Kazar is best in slot for Maya. Why? Why would it be best in slot? It doesn't heal me, <laughs> or slag. It doesn't. It, I need. I need to synergize things that synergize to my build. All right, let's go fight. Turn Marvels. Let's go. It's a, it's a legendary singularity. Okay, I'm I'm starting to think I'm starting to understand what you're saying. <laughs> starting to make sense. This fire diamond thinking, like I said, it's gonna be what we use for Terra. Let's do it. Group enemies up for chamber action. Okay, that makes sense. Bum, 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 bum. But this for this fight, I can't. I can't use it right now. I need, I need that extra healing. Alright, we're gonna try a slag and bag. 
We're gonna have Reaper for the first little bit here. Nice. A couple crits were landed there. Good chunk. Huge. Nice. Very sick. I'm gonna preemptively toss a a grenade here. If he ever wants to show himself, my grenade will turn around. Holy cow, I went too far. There we go. Good damage right there. This might be it for Terra. Nope, not quite. Let's hit this guy. Hey, whoa, whoa, now you want to start swiping? Oh, you want to start swiping when I turn my back? Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, Slayer of Terramorphous class mod. I th I think... War Accelerate, Mind's Eye, Spirit Release, Flicker. I don't know, I kind of want my cooldown reduction one. Melee damage, melee override. Cooldown? It's a joke. Our Rubberized Shock O negative is going to be a... It's actually kind of trash. What's that potent infection? That sounds like a fun weapon. Let's slap that puppy on. Alright, let's do it. Slag grenades are best in slot for Terra. Or best for Terra for sure. But not altogether necessary with Ruin. Yeah, I mean, yeah. That's what makes Maya really nice is uh, having access to Ruin. Being able to slag whenever, wherever, no questions asked. Yesterday, my fiance and I, when infection is damaged over time, might be okay on Maya, but generally not great. Yeah, I just, I don't get damage over time. Oh, a slag droog though. Do I have, a, do I have a, an opening for a weapon here? Yeah, I think it's gonna be maybe be I can get the sloth another try. I only used it for like a tiny bit. But the droog is just so so good. Fire so fast, so accurate. And I think it's the it's the fire rate and the accuracy. Fire rate 5.9, accuracy 93.9. Okay, let's do this. Okay, well, I wanted to try the uh this infection pistol. How does this work? Okay, let's just go just the pistol on this on this loader. That's that's good damage. I also wanted to try the stink pot. Someone did tell me to try it on Maya, so I will I will try it. All right, let's try this out. Stink pot against the fire damage enemy, gone. Okay, I had to reload. Nothing against it. This is this, this is it's, it's trial, it's interview with me. It, it seems pretty good so far. Oh, ow, ow, ow. Okay. Let's toss out some transfusion grenades. Okay. I like the Model 1 snipers on Maya. Vladov is for any, anybody else. I like... I like the, the Vladov snipers on everybody. I think they're just like... They're just like a, in a league of their very own, to be honest with you. Also, the Diamond Thinking is quickly becoming which my all-time favorite shotgun watch. I'm not even gonna... I'm gonna go up with a fire shotgun against the corrosive enemy. And because Cloud Kill exists, I don't have to worry. Just Diamond Thinking the whole map. This thing is just an absolute beast. Matching grip, vertical foregrip. An absolute beast of a gun. So. Sweet release. Wreck. I think the diamond thinking is... I put it definitely above the overkill at this point. Above a quad. I mean a quad with a tour grip probably. I've... Pretty much perfect parts in the shotgun. What is it? Is, it? is this a Jacob's grip? Oh, I'm sorry, a Jacob's stock on this one? Just like that, like thinner stock, or is it doll? 
No, it doesn't make shotguns. So yeah. Let's see. Okay, maybe it's time for the Kazar to come out. Bandit. Does the bandit stack help? What is the band what stats do the band does the bandit stock do? Does nothing. Oh, okay. Let's go. And what is the what is the gemstone for the Hyperion shotgun diamond thinking? Like is there a matching Like what is the gemstone? All right, where are you at? Right there. You can use wreck to wreck these dudes real fast. Put them down. Sir, uh, Maya has a little bit of Kriegener as well, where... Okay, wait. <laughs> because... Um... Because when you put someone up in phase lock, you've got a choice to make. You can either shoot them Get that kill and get your health back. Like in this case, I want to do probably. Or you can target other people and kill them instead, but you can't get your health back. Okay. Look in Dees. Look in Dees. Go more points into wreck. Uh. I don't I'm not even gonna go anything in this said uh, this go tree for now. I kinda just wanna keep up my my health and stuff. So kinetic reflection is nice. Let's go ward. Go ward kinetic reflection. That'd be good. Okay, this is a tough zone. Come on, don't die here. Okay. I need cloud code to come in handy right here. I know I'm using fire damage, but I'm trying to make a point. <laughs> How broken this thing is. Okay. I'll start tossing grenades at this guy right here. I need to I need to not do this the way I'm doing it right now. Just stop and think here for a second. I'm in the middle of a bajillion enemies. I don't have enough damage to kill this enemy in front of me. Let's throw on this. Honestly, I want to throw on. Let's, let's keep this. Let's use this infection pistol. And Gus go secondary. Okay, we're definitely gonna go down. Ow! 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 Okay, okay, we're we're fine. Put the ultimate badass loader. Get some get some space. Kill the other enemies. Okay, the ultimate badass is coming back to life now. Okay, we can swap to this bad boy. Put him up. Put him down. Good. Same thing with this guy right here. That way we can focus fire on this ultimate badass. Put him up. Decent damage coming out of this weapon right now. Oh, oh. Dodge, duck, do dive and dodge. Okay. Very nice. Let's go, baby. Boom, boom, ba -dum, boom. Getting through the zone is not easy. We're making good progress. Cloud kill, obviously helping out. This is when it gets really tricky. Three enemies to go, and the constructor can fire missiles, and you really don't have any place in this map for cover, except for in here, right? Well, this is this decent cover. This seems like okay cover. I can just I can fire out from afar at the sergeant loader or something. I think this is a pretty decent strategy. Put him up. He's not gonna like that very much. 13. 
And by doing it this way, I don't actually have to kill the uh, the large lad, I don't think. Okay. Yeah, despite being patient. This thing is kind of popping off. Nice. All right, now let's go into one point connect reflection and then suspension. Missiles are still flying, gotta be careful. I think will kill you easily. Yeah, I kind of got lucky that I didn't die up top right there. A little bit lucky, but it's fine. All right, let's see. What do we get? I am full. We are going to take mouthwash, obviously. Because if we get toothpick from the box, we go to the moon. Okay, drop the fire burst. Sorry, it's got to go. Anti-affection, no more. We'll keep the pistol damage. A lot of the stuff's gonna go. The creamer. Why don't we put the creamer up here instead of the Tenguska? There we go. It's a smarter move. Less damage, but at least it won't put us down as much. And when we go down, at least it won't kill us again and again and again and again. That's what I'm. That's what I'm really worried about. Let's see. I've never used this infectioner before, or inf uh, infection before. I like this. I do, I do, I do. Sipping on some water. Okay. Okay, so our next round for mobbing, let's do it. And fire damage is going to be needed here. The crystal damage can go. Do you have anything else you want to try out for this zone? I don't think so. I can try out this FaceTime. It's going to be a little bit more damage. But if we compare it to the one I was just using, it does more damage. At the cost of a little bit of fire rate. Honestly, I, there's no way it's better. Absolutely no way it's better. All right. Tusk and are there, and a are there. Just really mess these guys up. Only one Kzar at a time. I don't need to be chucking two. Okay. Obviously, we're going to one-shot him. Okay, you go up. You go down. Best part about this diamond thinking is that it only consumes one ammo. Like that's the big part. That's the biggest thing. Yeah, you sacrifice damage, but for Hyperion shotguns, you the damage comes from how many shots you can fire in a, in a row. It's kind of like having a Vladov shotgun without it actually being Vladov. Think of Hyperion. For me, Hyperion shotguns are like the. Are like the the Vladoff snipers. They're both they're they're, they're the one shot specialist weapons of the game. But the real best ones, a, a lot of the time, are the rapid fire ones. Kind of like Modern Warfare 2 with the AA12. Right. Oh yeah, that that was nice with the KZR and everything. All right, Assassin Wreath, drag him in. Put him up. Let's do another toss here. Later. He goes down. I run for my life. Okay, nice. What you drop me? A trespasser? If we get power P, I'll just I'll dink off his head. With that. I sh should have probably shot these these tires. I I will do it real quick. Actually, I got a Kzer. I don't really need anything besides a better adaptive shield. Okay, I don't want either of those. And five points into these skills is going to be good. Now, inertia. Or. Let's take Mind's Eye for crit damage. Having some extra crit damage is going to be very useful. I hope we fight Saturn here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be a decently easy fight for us. 
Tink Pot and even I think even like something like a Diamond Thinking, non elemental. Kazar not necessary. Instead, let's go for the homing slide transfusion. Toss that. Toss that. Looking just fine with this stink pot. Oh wow. All those rockets got destroyed. Oh, they're going up and around. This rocket is not safe. Whoa, guys. Can you chill out? Jeez, that was kind of intense, huh? If I go down, it's over, but... We're doing just fine. I don't have Reaper anymore. Ouch. He's gone. Hopefully these missiles don't kill me. Just keep running around. Whoa. Okay. Very, very nice. I need a legendary siren class mod, please. Oh, think about it doesn't count. Why does that not surprise me? Blockhead, Pimpernel, Remington's Edge, Love Stomper, Lightning Bolt. Okay, let's drop some stuff. Oh, I didn't even check that class mod. I took a case off for no reason. Holy brother. I already have a longbow one. It's okay. It was going to be a Slayer Term Service anyway. Don't worry about it. Keep the trespasser. Keep a Jolly Roger. Keep a Leco for sure. I totally forgot I had that. Okay. Looking okay. All right, Pimpernel is mine. Other than that, nothing here is really calling my name. I haven't gotten a chance to run the blockhead at all, or the, uh, the cowboy at all, though, but I do like the blockhead. Five more points. Let's go into here and then sustenance for some extra health regen at low HP. Sanctuary. All right, let's pull. We be pulling. We, got, we have a lot of different weapons. We're okay to do some pulls. Legendary Siren. Legendary Siren. Legendary Binder or Legendary Nurse. I mean, we are pretty specced into here. The only problem is the only skills that are really good is... The Nurse is, is nice. Don't get me wrong. But this one gives us... It's probably the same amount of healing for single player, honestly. All right, Hornet is a good corrosive damage pistol. If we need it. Again, if we get Hyperius, we'll be happy to have it. Okay, there's Toothpick. Obviously, that's our new number one. Toothpick. I don't have my mouthwash. Okay, it's, no, it's not my new number one. Peak opener. We're going to put more... Points into a Sarifles. Go. And go fight a raid boss. Who do we get? Okay, so it is going to be corrosive damage requirement here. Let's start off with a little bit of a rinse to the, to the face here. See how my damage is. Damage is good against this guy. Now. Let's take a... The infection did well for us uh, last round, so... Maybe the stink pot would be good too. Okay. Very nice. Hornet is better than infection. Is it though? I mean, it is good though. I like using the hornet. I just use it a lot. Oh yeah. Pull him in. Oh, I have a Kazar. I can... Let's just pull these laddies in a little bit so that my cloud kill affects them all. Yes. We want the cloud kill to kill them all at the same time. Matching grip too. That's a great hornet. Is it? Okay, okay. Six. Okay. 
Okay, keep pulling them in. Cloud killed them down. They gotta be, they gotta be taking deeps in there. There's no way they're not. That's my bad. I need to use it on the boss here. I do have a singularity. I can always just pull them into the boss again. Malo on sites too. Oh yeah, these Malo on sites are dope. Okay. The cloud kill is gonna rinse them all. That's 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 the whole point of getting on top of them. Drag them in. Make sure the cloud kill goes over the robots. Super easy fight, honestly. Like, Drag them all in. Make sure it goes over the robots. Rinse and repeat. They all have their shields up though right now. That's a tough one. Once they have their shields down, I can rinse them. Come on. Okay, we're, we do get one kill right there. Or close to one kill. Connect refle reflection. Would that block those missiles? I hope so. Okay, they're starting to drop. They are starting to give way. Only one or two remain to remain. Yeah, it looks like it's just Hyperius now. We can sw switch back up. How about we go a little bit of toothpick, a little bit of blockhead. Fire diamond thinking, honestly. And where's that blockhead? I want to try that too. This game hates me though. It's going to make me put on the toothpick. <laughs> we all saw that. Okay, he's coming after me. The K are a waste uh, for this fight. Slide transfusion will be much better. Okay. Slag up. I'm not sure how much damage that's doing, but I'm okay with it. The side. Sustenance is helping out here. I do need some uh, grenages back, that's for sure. Oh, that could be the end of me. I didn't pick them up. That's bad news. He's actually starting to be dangerous here. I need to get grenades and then toss grenades. Oh, to the side, to the side, to the side, to the side. I got one transfusion out there. Okay. Get a couple more. Oh, I'm already full health. We're chilling. My, well, my connect reflection was popping off for something. Oh, I get it. After taking damage, I see, I see. Oh, that hurt. There's my transfusions. Okay, they're coming back to me. Whoa, to the side, to the side, to the side. We're making it happen. Very clean. Bum 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 ba dum bum 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 dum bum bum. Retcher. Nukem. I guess we take a retcher. I don't know. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna be using it, but Okay, Florentine or Tadler? I'd like the Tadler, I really like the Florentine. The Tadler's got big deeps though, right? The Florentine's just good. This but it's its damage is almost triple with a higher fire rate. With that being said, I'm going to go Tadler. I go Florentine all the time. Let's go Tadler. And try Blockhead. All right, we'll try Blockhead. So many weapons in here, though. It's hard to find what I'm looking for. There we go. Oh, and it, it gives me the wrong one anyway. Thank you, Borderlands, for your amazing UI. Okay. Okay. 
Above the seraphs. Sean. To opportunity. This one should be fine. Just really showing, doing some, uh, some parkour here. Feeling pretty good on this this Maya run, especially coming off that Krieg run where we got all the way. I kind of want to play more Krieg and do more melee Krieg because it felt really, really good. But this Maya run is feeling good too. That UI was meant for controller. It's buggy when with the mouse. Yeah, I completely agree with you. But it's funny how pro it's it's probably the PC community that is is putting in the absolute like most hours overall. But yeah, I completely get it. Consoles where the money's at. And also, I mean, if they were, if they were console gamers, they're gonna want to make a console game. So we're gonna have to really focus on getting. Oh yes, finally. Just the, the recharge delay in itself is just so much so helpful right there. We're gonna really want to focus on getting ourselves a a, a a mouthwash toothpick combo going. So that means finding all the Borderlands symbols. I think I know where the one is on this map, but like usually one of the relics gets away from me. It's like a weird, it's like a weird interaction. I don't have a cat class mod on, but I have a binder. Go down, homie. I'm gonna try blockhead as well. Give me that blockhead. Oh yeah, like the blockhead for sure. I have a man, I've always liked the blockhead. Let's go. I like it on uh, Hellborn Krieg, especially. I'm not gonna swap. <laughs> I almost never swap for shields. I know my I know my phase lock will come up eventually and just want me to rinse them down. Oh, I want a Kzar here. Longbow, obviously. Toss. Come on. Dude, th th these guys. The backup strats. Alright. Toss a Kazar. Toss a Kazar. Very nice. Super badass. We'll see about that. Didn't think so. Didn't think so. Kazar. Oh yeah, it was definitely a PC game in a launch for sure. Super badass Torg Enforcer. Hopefully the uh, the ruin will strip a shield for me and then I can. Oh my gosh. Maya Deeps when you have somebody phase locked is so insane. Strip that shield for me. Good enough. I'll take it from there. Is that a crit accessory on that blockhead? I'm not too sure. This is the accessory piece right here, or no? I mean, it does plus 50% critical hit damage. So, it seems pretty nice. It's kind of doing insane damage right now. Okay. A Ketra or a, another blockhead? Okay, so I can actually look at this. It, this one doesn't have as good stats. And it doesn't have the critical hit damage. Very interesting. Oh, left side. Oh, this is the accessory right here. Oh, the little crit laser. That is that what that is? Yeah, the little laser looking thing. Yeah, I know what you mean. The opposite side. Very cool. I think sustenance is important. Life tab is also important. Against dragons, life tab's not that that crazy, but I like to go defense at least a little bit. Look at us go reversing this zone. Up and over. Borderland simple me. Let's see, nope, didn't get either one of the ones that I want. That's okay though. What do you got for me? 
Nothing, nothing. Blackhead kind of popped off in that flash area. For sure. Go next. The Tadler didn't really, honestly. I thought the Tadler might, but it didn't. Oh, this is one, one of the Frostburn. There's one Frostburn Canyon stage I, I don't like as much. This is not the one. Hey, chill out. Chill out. Let me get that incendiary damage relic. Okay. Toss a grenade out. Whoa, whoa. Hey, chill out. Chill out with that fire. A Nomad Arsonist. Is that what it is? Is that what you're about, huh? Get that reload off just, just because I don't want to have to have to reload it. Like, just like this, this Tadler. When I swap off without reloading, it comes back to bite me in the end. There we go. Yeah, element of bat Elemental Tadler is way better. Yeah, this one just doesn't seem very good. I wish I took the Florentine. That's okay. I got a peak opener. Let's just slap that on. And cooldown. There we go. Okay. The Snyder is nice, but I'm not gonna take it. Let's go, let's go. Cause I don't wanna have to swap weapons as much. Okay, the sauce case already on the ground. Out. Easy. Very easy. Oh, what is that? Thunderball Fist? No thanks. Hydra or Roaster? Okay, now even more slag. Hmm. This tree is done. Let's go to this right side tree and put Fleet on. We like fleet for when we for when our shields go down. We want the extra movement speed. That way, nothing can uh, like slow moving projectiles. Kind of like Hyperus. Like we would have liked to have it for that Hyperus fight, to be honest with you. But Hyperus fight, having having fleet is really nice. All right, we just peek opener for a little bit. Life tap, kind of insane. Especially for mobbing. And Maya mobbing is ridiculous. Okay. Hide for a second. No, I didn't get my life tap going. It'll be just fine here, though. Yeah. Nice. I bet you if I swap weapons to a creamer or something like that. That I'll, that I'll, well, it'll, it'll, it'll full heal me and the grenades will do the damage from the creamer. I bet you that's how it works. Do I swap up like that? There's a pressure plate back behind the metal thing towards the entrance. Oh, really? Somewhere around here where I'm standing? Is it around here? Oh, last map. Oh, sorry. Okay. The pistol damage, max health damage, we're good. Again, peak opener is getting us through this pretty pretty simply. It's not close with damage, but doesn't really matter if it one shots the earth. I walk a little bit forward here, that way the door opens and we can farm it. But we don't actually have to kill those guys. We can just go ahead and kill that guy over there. Or this EXP loader. Either one. Alright, 71. Another stink pot, why not? <laughs> All guns are corrosive with her, true. Alright, fleet. Some cooldown on my phase lock, even more. The more, the more cooldown on phase lock we get, the more healthy we will be. Uh, let's pull these two. 
Nope. Okay. Go next. Bloodshot Stronghold, not the matchup I, I was looking to see. Not. This is not good. I'm nervous. Um, I am quite nervous. I just want to push to the upstairs as quickly as possible. Let's toss some, some Kzars down. And then a little bit of that right there. Get some life steal going. Kzar him. Put him up. Put him down. There we go. Okay, we got a shot. We got our, ourselves one of the, uh, the, the, t the TVs already. TV number two. Let's grab that on the stairs. Decent stair climb right there. That stair climb is big. Don't take as much damage. Fanatic reflection is so huge right there. Oh, he's right on top of me. Not good. We're okay. Life still coming in. We need to push through this zone. Pull them in, chain, chain reflection them down, or chain, whatever it is. Yeah, chain reaction. Put them up. Put them down. I wish I kind of had it for this for this part of the fight, but I can see see them. Bad Mike, you gotta go up. Sick. Great. That's a great zone for Maya. I'm happy we have Maya for that mobbing zone. Makes it so much simpler. Alright. Let's see. No plasma casters at all? There's a shock top Nia. I'm, my inventory is full though. I gotta drop some stuff. Legendary binder, legendary cat. Okay, a legendary cat class mod is noise. But I'm not sure I have the... The SMGs to really make it work. Zendir damage. I got two of these sheriff's badges. One can go for sure. Lako can make these. These are basically identical. Yeah, that's crazy. Take that top, Nia. Cats are overrated ammo. Only really good for bosses. Yeah, I think cats are good. Just not right now. Let's go accelerate. I know that's not going to make the pimper all that useful. That's okay though. Pimper all doesn't have to be that crazy. But we're not going to be getting the mouthwash two-pick combo, it doesn't look like, so. Buckle up, buttercups. I believe in us. I believe in us more than I believe in him. That's for sure. Let's do... Transfusion. There we go. Good damage. This guy be his eyeballs out of the crit spot, right? Oh, I gotta use Scorn. I, got, I haven't been using Scorn at all. That's my bad. Okay, pull him in. Okay, can I can I get some uh, some kills, from Mayhaps? Scorn out. Get to the side. There we go. Some kills. Got a long cooldown scoring though, I feel like. Put him up. While it's active. Oh dang. That's tough. I wanna put one up I wanna put one of these dwarves up. And then swap. To do some damage to the boss. Not bad. Put one of these other guys up. Use wreck on the boss, and he goes down. Pretty clean, pretty clean. Do we got boss damage for the dragons? I don't know. We can try. Impaler, deliverance, 
Uncapped Herald. Uncapped Herald's probably gonna be good. The crit is in his belly, that round thing in his abdomen. Oh, really? Is it? Okay. The Avenger. I'm not gonna be using the Avenger. Infinity or Legendary Siren class mod. Let's go. That's pretty big. That's pretty big. Let's go. No, I don't want to respec. I want to head into the next zone. So... How are we going to kill these dragons? I think bringing down the green one could be good for us. But the thing is, we're just going to get one shot. We don't have a B shield. So... I just don't know how it's going to happen. We're going to need... I want more grenades for transfusions. More launcher for launcher shots. Okay. And I'm going to get a great pull here. Over in Comet Sierra Volcano. Alright, so. Our first weapon that we're going to go through is going to be a... We're going to go Uncapped Herald. I need something that can tag them from far away. Something that can tag from far away. Toothpick will be good for all but fire one, but the toothpick, I don't have the mouthwash. But I can try it. I have a shred of fire as well. Creamer, or should I rock a nuke him? I don't, I don't want to be greedy. Do a lot more damage. More magazine size. I think it's going to be better. Creamer can heal, though. Creamer can heal. It'll be better in our time of need. So if we get in trouble, swap to Creamer, shoot. Where to go? There it is. Okay. And yeah, sure. Let's go Toothpick as well. Where it be? Where it be? Where it be? There it is. Okay, time to fight some dragons. Can we go back to back? Um, I got. I have my doubts. Uh, the blockhead. I. The blockhead will come in after the toothpick is done. I need something that can just just ding these guys. A tattler. Okay, we can do it. Harold is obviously good too. I'm concerned about healing. Yeah, I'm concerned about healing too. I have this creamer. Right, let's get the green one down. And just hold this creamer out. Okay. Hey, where are you going? How can you already be... How can you already be... Uh... Ah, that's not good, man. Yeah, he's going to spawn in some lighties though. I'm not even worried about it. There we go. Give me, give me that life steal. There we go. The hardest time in the dragons is, is the very beginning. So, if we can get through this first little bit by keeping the, the green one on the ground, things could be okay for us. Give me that creamer. Okay, pistol damage. Grow up if we get in trouble. That does, we're doing good damage to him. Really good damage. Again, scroll up if we get in trouble. I have another green guy on the ground here. Scroll up if we get in trouble. Creamer out. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. There we go. Who can I hit? You get down here. I need I need some more laddies. Thank you. Hit him again. More laddies. Thank you. Wow. Actually, we're, we're starting to starting to figure this out a little bit more. This guy's got laddies for me. I'm okay. I wish I was reloaded already, but that is what it is. Okay. Life steal helping me right there. After, I mean, we're gonna have life steal every time after fire for our life. 
Yeah, we're gonna need a creamer here though for sure get some of that heal juice going I don't like how he's uh, healing up with the lads though that's for sure 26 shots is decent though with the creamer no I don't have to I don't want to have to kill this guy but we gotta do it Come on, don't 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 do me like this creamer thank you 23 shots is, is a good amount of shots left. Can you chill out, bro? I need a heal. Okay, looking okay. I need to get the green one down if I can. Green one down, green one down. You. Please. I hit him. Please. Reward me. There we go. He's on the ground. More laddies, if you could. There we go. All right. Toothpick time. Gotta switch back to my creamer. Dang. I'm, I'm struggling right now. I'm running out of ammo. We're looking okay. I mean, the, their health bars are going down. Mine is rapidly going down and up. <laughs> I think I healed a little bit there, though. No, it didn't work out. No, 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 no. Okay, I got one. I still got one here. Huge. Okay. I need to toss nades here for sure. Transfusion grenades to keep me healed up. Obviously. Okay. At this point, we it's it's a survive. It's a survive. Fire. Heal and pray. Heal and pray. Heal and pray. Until we can try to get this green one back on the ground. Back on the ground. If you could. And we'll try in time if you can. Yeah, it is ammo try in time. Let's go. Keep up the damage on that guy. It's a marathon, not a sprint. Okay, let's. Where's the green guy? Mr. Green, Mr. Green. Mr. Green, you gotta come down here if you can. I'd very much appreciate it if you came down here. All the way over there? Not cool. Not cool, bro. Oh, he, he spawned in the guy. No, I, why did I shoot? Why did I just wait? Oh, GG. Good run. I think we're starting to figure out that dragon fight a little bit more. So I'm a little bit less scared about it each time now, but that was a good fight. GG. Very, very nice run.